Deep within the pages of the Book of Exodus lies a captivating narrative that sheds light on an often overlooked aspect of the Bible, five extraordinary women who initiated a profound shift in tradition. Set against the backdrop of the 43 years since the Exodus from Egypt, this tale revolves around a crucial juncture, just before the Israelites were poised to enter the Promised Land. Moses, guided by the divine voice of Yahweh, was presented with a unique method for apportioning tribal territories through a lottery system. In this arrangement, every male within a tribe would inherit a designated portion of land, ensuring its continuity within the family line. Amidst this framework emerges the daughters of Zelophehad, whose journey emboldened them to challenge the prevailing norms. A significant lineage was born through Zelophehad, a participant in the Exodus and a pilgrim en route to the land of promise under Moses' leadership. Tragically, most of his contemporaries never tasted the fruit of their journey, perishing in the wilderness. With Zelophehad's demise, his daughters were gripped by a grave concern. Would they, as females, be denied a rightful inheritance in the impending division of land? Their dilemma catapulted them into action, propelling them to seek guidance from none other than Moses himself. These courageous women, May, Lola, Noah, Hogla, Milkand, Tirza, hailing from the tribe of Manasseh, made a daring request before the assembly of leaders, including Moses and Eleazar the priest. In their eloquent plea, they highlighted their father's righteous history and their own innocence, asserting that their father had not participated in previous rebellions. They posed a fundamental question, why should their father's name be erased from the annals of his tribe merely because he had no sons? Their appeal pivoted on securing their rightful inheritance as daughters. Moses' response to their plea speaks volumes about his wisdom and humility as a leader. Rather than making a unilateral decision, Moses turned to God for guidance. This interaction provides a glimpse into the potential workings of case law in ancient Israel. Notably, Moses did not allow his authority to cloud his judgment displaying a characteristic humility that sought God's specific direction. The divine response Moses received bore remarkable implications. The Lord acknowledged the legitimacy of the daughter's plea, mandating that they should indeed receive a portion of their father's inheritance. More groundbreaking was the decree that if a man died without male heirs, his daughter should inherit his estate an unprecedented shift in the laws of inheritance that demonstrated God's impartiality and concern for all his children. The divine instruction in emphasized the masculine word give in Hebrew, signifying that women in such circumstances were entitled to the same privileges as men. The daughters of Zelophe had left an indelible mark on the biblical narrative. Their audacious yet righteous appeal helped crystallize the law of inheritance for Israel, which stipulated the order of inheritance as son, daughter, brother, paternal uncle, and closest relative within the clan. Importantly, property could not be transferred outside one's tribe. Their story also underscores God's special care for the vulnerable, widows, and orphans, as evidenced in various passages throughout the Bible. This tale of Zelophehad's daughters magnifies the significance of courage and boldness in the face of adversity. Their act of approaching Moses, even at the entrance of the tabernacle, the locus of leadership assemblies and divine judgments emanated from unwavering faith. Their unwavering faith and determination opened the gateway to justice leading to the establishment of a permanent law that would safeguard the rights of future generations. The daughter's legacy extended beyond their legal triumph. Their resolute spirit serves as an enduring testament to the power of faith, boldness, and perseverance. Their courage to challenge norms ushered in an era where women were rightfully included in inheritance and property matters marking a step toward equality and fairness within the ancient society. 
As we reflect on this remarkable narrative, let us be reminded of the enduring lessons it imparts. Let us take solace in the assurance that God is the father of the fatherless and the champion of justice for the marginalized. Let us also draw inspiration from the daughters of Zelophehad, whose unyielding courage transformed not only their own destinies, but also the course of biblical history. As we face challenges and obstacles in our own lives, may we be fueled by their example to stand strong, to seek wisdom, and to embrace courage as we navigate the intricate tapestry of our own. If you found this video enjoyable, please consider liking and sharing it. Additionally, subscribing to this channel will ensure that you receive more updates in the future. Thank you.